follow me. It's like MTV Cribs, you know? We're yes. Like kitchen Cribs. How fun is this? Huh? So welcome to the Spoggle Kitchen. Uh, just a brief introduction about Spoggle. It is Chef Wolfgang's first restaurant. It's a flagship restaurant. It originally started in 1982 in West Hollywood. And then we got this location in 97. Now when you say Kitchen. West Hollywood, that was the one with the white tent that they put on because they expanded during the Oscar parties. The exactly. after party. He worked there, so he, he could tell you. <laughs> during the after Oscar parties that... The spa goes on sunset. Yes, it was yes. huge, and, and, there, oh, the and there was no parking, so the cars had to park at the Tower Records it's because they got were so big. Yeah. 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 There you go. So you know yeah. what we're talking yes. about. Yes. Oh, across the street to the hotel too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Chateau Mamont, a little yeah. farther down. Yeah. I know. Yeah. So this is pizza oven. So yes, this is our this is our brew station. This is our pizza station. It All is 100% right. wood burning pizza. Now oven. I didn't see any pizzas on your menu. I guess it's it's special. Yes. It is a, it's a, we don't want to be known as a pizza house, right. we're known for selling pizzas, yes. but uh, one of our, <laughs> our most iconic dish is uh, smoked salmon pizza. Beautiful. Uh, a nice pizza crust, dill cream, red onions, and smoked salmon that we cure and smoke in-house. Wow. Uh, that is so fantastic. That, that is the first dish that puts Bago Who Hate Puck on the map. So our pizza oven is a 100% wood burning pizza oven using no gasoline at all. Um, it cooks around 600 degrees and it uses oak wood. Um, this station too is where we also make our tuna tartar cones that we had earlier. Yes, that was absolutely fantastic. So this item right here is our same exact item that we've been serving at the Oscars for the past 25 years. Now what is that cone made of? That, now is that cone made out of that same flat sesame, flat? sesame miso cone. Miso cone. Sesame miso cone, that is correct. Here we have a lovely pasta station. Um, I'm not sure. Did any of you try our pasta? We did. Squidding. Squidding is amazing yeah. too, yeah. So, our pasta is amazing here. Uh, and the really cool thing about all of our pasta is handmade, fresh, in house, every single day. Uh, the second cool thing about it is the person who prepares it for us is, is, a, is a guy named S.A. He's one of our prep cooks. He's been with the company for 31 years. And in all 31 years, his job task has remained the same. It's to make pasta. So he is a master pasta maker. He's been making pasta as long as I've been breathing air. So you can imagine how good he is, you know? Um, and the best thing about it, too, his salary has remained the same for all 31 years. <laughs> yeah! That's a joke. That's going to cut. Um, we're going to send that to the labor board. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Slave labor. <laughs> So uh, yeah. over there's our sauté our sauté station. Our style of cooking here is called a la minute, French term, and what that means is that we make everything from scratch as it is ordered. There's no heat lamps, there's no microwaves, there's nothing keeping the food hot or warm. Once that food is cooked, plate it down here, drop it on the back, so we have a lovely food under the black flavor of the food. We have the your table. Wow. Isaac! <laughs> I said, look, here we have our fire. Fire. This is fire. 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 our beef, veal, lamb, and pork. Now, all of our fish, however, is from the back station. And the reason why we do that, in case we have any pescatarians, we can rest assure them that there's going to be no cross contamination. Right, all. right. What is the back to the sauce of the sauce? The other French term, essentially, is just a fancy term for our pantry station. This is where all of our cold items come out of. Um, we have our mixture of raw fish. We have our salad, our octopus that can be here. And, our, and, our, and, our, and, our, and then our last station. This is the station that's making your food right now. Dessert. That's yes. right. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> so over here we're making all of our ice creams, sorbets, gelatos, which are all made in house. In the back over there is where we make all of our pastries, and where we also make all of our bread. And right now she's starting your strudel too. Oh wow! I think he wants to start. He wants to start eating the strudel. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, how much fun it's like going yeah. to Disneyland! Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, that is the tour of the kitchen. And you have approximately 20 chefs on duty, is that what I heard? Uh, yes, so right now we have probably about 20 workers. We have a one uh, executive sous chef. Uh, we have an uh, executive pastry chef. Um, and about two suit like ranks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And everyone's food prep for the bag. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah back to the food What food an operation. Prep. This is, and and remind yeah. everybody, this is a Monday night, it which is, traditionally yeah. is the slowest yeah. night in the it restaurant is, industry. Is. And this is a yes. slow Monday night. I'm telling you, like, other Monday nights is crazy. It's but it, full, but um, what we need to tell them is, is that we're in the city of Beverly Hills, and this is not a slow night. And, That's right. And, and this is, it is Hollywood Glitz. Never, <laughs> never a slow night in Beverly Hills. <laughs> All right, so thank you very much. And thank you. It's been it's a it. pleasure. All right, thank you. It's been a pleasure. <laughs>
2019. Chris's birthday. Mertz Fagos in beautiful Beverly Hills, California. Yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, he's taking a video, so come on, do all the work. Do whatever you want. Do whatever you want. Oh, that's the same. How fun is this? Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you. Now, what is this thing? This is strawberry sorbet. The strawberry sorbet. That's correct. You toss like little cookies, apple strudel, vanilla ice cream inside. Yes. Wow. This is the other half of yes. this plate. Uh huh. Chocolate souffle. Chocolate souffle. Right. <laughs> and then we got more plates coming. No, stop! Don't, don't! You're killing me. All right. So I'm gonna make a wish. Please do. And. Uh, October 21st, 2019, and we just had a fantastic 53rd birthday of me, of course, at Spago's in beautiful Beverly Hills. Um, we're on Cannon, and if you ever notice, there's a lot of stuff on Cannon now. So that was Spago's. This closed. This was called Citizen, right? It closed for good, Marty? Yeah, it's done. It's done. And there's a bunch of stuff on here. The Palm Restaurant's down here. Uh, Mastro's is down on this street. Nick's used to be down here, and they closed, and still nothing's there. What else was here, Marty? There's Wally's. Wally's. Wine bar a lot of time. And uh, grew up as a kid, Beverly is next over, and that's where my dad had his office building when I was a kid, uh, when I was uh, in junior high. And of course, uh, the montage, the montage is right here. And uh, that's where he parked her car. So if you want to keep walking with us, we'll, uh, we'll walk through here. Now it's a Monday night, so uh, not much really going on. But Spago's was packed. For a Monday night, and they said that their busiest night of the uh, week is on a Monday night. So, uh, I know what time it's. Uh, what time is it? It's almost ten o'clock at night. Mm, nine. All right, and then you can see how beautiful the montage is here. Of course, that's Wilshire Boulevard, but uh, we can't get through because it's under construction. We'll see you later. Bye.